Yeah, alright, alright, alright. You was right, I was wrong. Yeah, I should've never ever took her home. Hey everyone, Curls and Curls here, okay, Courtney. And if you're new, if you're not, welcome back to the Crazy Familiar with my hot mess of a channel. Um, I've been gone for a while, but I apologize about that. I'm sorry. There's a lot of shit going on, you know what I'm saying? Like school and then technical difficulties where I, you know, my videos wouldn't upload and then it's me being lazy and not wanting to film anything. Dry spell, you know. But I'm back with a new video. Today I'm going to be doing a Fashion Nova try on haul. I want to be very, very clear that, you know, I wear what I want and I wear what I feel great and confident in. And if you don't like it, bye. <laughs> Exit the video. Have a nice day. Okay. Bye. We don't need any negativity over here. We're good. We're good. I'm plus size. I'm proud. I don't care. Whatever. All right. It's whatever. If you don't like it, bye. Go away. Period. Go away. But anyway, this is my first time trying Fashion Nova. And yeah, let's see how this goes. So if you want to see this try on haul, then keep on watching. So the first thing I'm going to talk about is the piece I'm wearing right now, which, you know, when I do trial hauls, I'm going to start wearing a piece that's low-key, like my favorite, I guess, or the last piece I tried on. So this is the No Manners skirt set. It is like a super cropped tank top or cami I guess you can call it like a bralette or something and the skirt is super high waisted like the skirt the skirt goes like past my stomach it is very very um fitted I got this in a wet X it was like 20 something dollars probably no more than 30 dollars I paid for this and it's a really really thin material so you might be able to see some panties coming through like you might be able to see those. But other than that, I think with shapewear, it's pretty... I can probably make it work. I don't know what kind of bra you would wear with it. Probably a strapless. But honestly, I think I would probably have to wear a bra because of how thin it is. I don't want any nipple ha nipples showing or nothing like that. And I don't want get any support from it because it's so thin. So I'm probably going to end up just wearing a regular strap bra. Probably for like a duster. Or like how I wore it now, like a denim jacket over it. it. Yeah, I like this set. I really do. I just feel like it's not very, um, it's not super flattering in the stomach area. But, you know, I'm still wear it. You know what I'm saying? Because like, with shapewear, I'm good. You know, I'm good. The next thing I'm going to talk about is called the Jacqueline Love Dress, I believe. It is an off-the-shoulder dress. I got it in the shade, I believe it's Rose. I think it's in a shade of rose. I'm not sure. But I got it in a 1X and I absolutely love the dress. It goes to the knee on the model. It went like... On the model, it was like halfway, like almost to the knee. So I was kind of scared for me, but I remember how slender my body is. And I don't have much uh, booty, I guess. So literally, everything's going to be really long on me. But nonetheless, I like it. And... I wore it with a bra and the try on. I wore both items with a bra. And I do like it with the bra. I just feel like it's not really realistic for me to wear it with a bra because, I mean, I don't want to wear a bra with it. I don't think I have to because it, the material is really thick. So, I mean, why would I want to wear a bra? I mean, like, I'm just saying. But. It's really good material. It has just like a, I guess like a, it's called like a ruffly, it's like a ruffly detail around the, the shoulder portion of it, like around here. And it has a ruffly detail on the 
like the end of the sleeves. The buttons are not functional, but I do like the buttons on it because I don't want any buttons popping off when I'm sitting down or anything. Like, that's not going to happen. I think I got it in a 1X. I think I said that already. I got it in a 1X, and it was like $28. It was more expensive than all the other ones, all the other colors. So, I think it was like $28. And I saw Daquan White wearing it in her Fashion Nova haul, and I was like, I got to have it. 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 It's so pretty. Like... I gotta have it and when I finally got it I was like oh the color looks very very dark like compared to compared to the website and I was like we doing what we doing the inside of it is lined. I didn't really show the lining because I didn't want to have no peep shows or anything. But the inside of it is lined. Here, I can show you what it looks like. It's right here. So this is what it looks like, right? I'm not gonna. It's not gonna do you no justice. Trust me. Like it has white cotton lining in it, presented from being see through. However, I'm gonna have to wear shaper with it because it's not super flattering in the stomach area. But yeah, it's a little roughly detail at the collar. And at the end of the sleeves, like this, it's actually a really stretchy material, like, super stretchy. The buttons are like a wooden button, and they don't function, like I said. So, yeah, absolutely love this dress. You will see it in a lookbook soon. When I do, like, a outfit I'm taking on vacation with me, or, like, a summer lookbook or something like that. So, yeah. So then I ordered two pairs of sandals. I got these sandals. I'll leave the name on the screen. I got these in a size 10. They're, the, they're these, like, it's this neon color. I wore these a couple times before, as you probably can tell. But they're really, the band is really stretchy. So you don't have to, like, clasp it like the other shit I'm going to show you. So it's, like, really stretchy. Like, it's stretchy. So you just dip your foot in and then, you know, put this around the, the heel. This band's also a little stretchy, like a little bit, not a whole lot, or no stretch at all. This has no stretch to it, but it still fits really well. It's actually they're actually really, really comfortable. I wore these around campus and they're really bright. So I'm I'm with the neon this summer. Like I'm with neon shoes, but this is what they look like. Super cute. Here's the other one, just in case you wanted to know what it looked like. Do the same. The next pair of shoes I got are these. I'll leave this, I'll leave, like, like I said, I'll leave the, all the names on the screen. But these are also a size 10. I think these are a little bit too, um, they're really roomy. So I probably could have sized down. But nonetheless, I do like them. I like the way they fit. Um, basically, they're like a strappy sandal. So basically, you just like strap it around your ankle and then tie it at the buttons. At the little, what are these called? Little belt things, the belt loops right here. And it also zips up in the back, which I'm very happy about. And this is in the color nude or oatmeal or something like that. I don't know what color this is because you know, I'm not going to call it. So I'm going to call it nude. But yeah, I really like these shoes. They're actually really comfortable. I also wore these on campus too. So that's what this shoe looked like. They're not Dita sandals. They're not called Dita sandals. I don't remember what they're called, but they're not Dita sandals. But these are no Wardy sandals. But. Yeah, I really like these shoes. And that concludes my Fashion Nova haul. I hope you all enjoyed it. If you did, please like, comment, and subscribe to the channel. You know, come back and see more videos. I probably have to go ghost like that again, but you know, shit happens, okay? But would I try Fashion Nova again? I absolutely would. I was very, very impressed with my Fashion Nova order. I really, really liked everything that I that I got. Kind of knew I would because, you know, I'm not very picky when it comes to clothes. I mean, not really. Just don't disappoint me. But I really do like Fashion Nova's clothing. You know, they have a lot of um, a bad reputation about their about their uh, website and their service and everything like that. I haven't experienced anything bad from them. I haven't really gotten a coupon or like a um, anything like, like, you know, like those little gift cards or anything like that. I've never got that problem before. This is my first time ordering, so I never got that problem at all. But... I probably would get that problem, but to be honest, I'm not too bothered by it. Like, not really, because 
I mean, I am. I am, because it's really not necessary for your for you to say they're out of stock when they're on their way. Like, that's kind of disappointing. But other than that, I like the I like the website. Now, there's rumors about it being like an overpriced rainbow or something like that. I still buy from Rainbow, obviously, because my last haul was a rainbow haul. I love rainbow. I fuck a rainbow very hard. Like, I love rainbow, period. So, if I like something, I'm going to get it, regardless if it's from Payless, which is, like, not even open anymore. Um, Old Navy, like, if I like it, I'm going to buy it, period. But, yeah, anyways, thanks for watching, and I'll see you in my next video. Bye. Oh, 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 oh